tell me I just wanna get my family out these streets At war with myself, they tryna figure out what's wrong with me Been pulling for cause I can't go to sleep I seen the closest to me walk out, said they never leave All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back. Blazing questions, episode 18. 18 interviews. We've been grinding these bitches out, bro. <laughs> so welcome back, man. Blazing questions where we bring you the best gems, the best talents, the best bloggers, the best hustlers, hey, the best artists. If you're on this channel, you are a unique talent. You know what I'm saying? So appreciate everyone that we've been interviewing, everyone that's been tapped in, everyone liking, subscribing. All the above, man. We just reached a thousand subscribers. So shout out to y'all, man. Really tapped in, commenting, liking, showing the love. So with that being said, man, we out here in Chicago, Northwest Indiana. And we want to show some love to an upcoming blogger, man, going crazy out here. So we, as a fan, <laughs> we tapped in. We tapped in, liking, following all the new artists and stuff that's coming up. So if you see you here, go ahead, look in that camera, let the people know your name and what you do. I'm um, Preston Lake. I run uh, two blogs, uh, Underground Raps, and then uh, Indiana Up Next. Hey. Basically, just promoting all underground, the under the whole underground scene, really. Okay, so how you get into it? So I've been since like I was in middle school. I would I had SoundCloud, so I would I would be listening to underground artists. Like I'm talking like like ten likes on SoundCloud. <laughs> he said, "Look, like I was listening to all these I love dudes. music, man. I really did. So." I, I started to think, I was like, man, some of these dudes, I think, deserve more recognition. So, you know, I'll list them. And then I really didn't think about the page and starting one until about a year after I graduated high school. And I was just like, I was like working my factory job. I'm like thinking, I'm like, man, I kind of want to just, I need a hobby, you know? And so I was like, man, what do I like? I was like, I like music. I'm like, hold up. And I kind of like made an underground rap page. It's, that's kind of what started it. Hey. <laughs> and then... I didn't make Indiana up next until like a year later, like because I was just like, man, Indiana's got a lot of talent, I was like, but they're all hidden. Like, there's no platform for them to grow. Okay. So. So, so I just made Indiana up next, and then kind of just went on with it. Okay. So like, are you going and searching artists? Or artists hitting you up? How's it coming? So it's a good mix of both. Like, every time I scroll, I check like every single tag like of an artist I already follow. And they like will tag like someone they feature a song in with, and I'll just click them and just try to follow artists that I like I and just try to find them. And then sometimes I'll I always check my message requests. So I I I often have a lot of like messages from artists like yo check this out or so you know. Yeah, I mean your platform is you know getting up there, man. I, yeah. I'm I'm tapped in like I said. So I be searching, I be looking. I'm like okay. I, it's a lot of artists I don't know of. So, cause I, like I said, I'm in Colorado. Mm -hmm. So I come out here periodically every couple months. So it's nice to see your page and tap in with different artists. Like, oh shit, I didn't know. <laughs> you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. So that's fire as, as far as a viewer goes. Uh -huh. But um, like you said, putting artists on, on platforms and stuff like that. Um, like we were saying off camera, do you got any shows or anything you trying to uh, you know, so get for them? I want to I wanna get a show going somewhere around the region area probably more out towards gary just because that's where most of my f my following is from right now okay but i also kind of want to connect with south bend and indianapolis but you know i got i got a little vision in my head hey. so i'm just trying to slowly Each step, man. It, yeah yeah, yeah. It's, it's, baby steps right now what you do you know just get an artist or a, a venue or something then mm -hmm. you know start there so yeah. anywhere you can it would be ideal yeah in my head but uh how long have you been running the blog? You said you started right out of high school? Yeah, so like I made underground raps uh, August 2020. And yeah, yeah, August 2020. And I just kind of just kind of kept going with it. And then like a year later, November 2021, I made Indiana Outfest. So do you watch any blogs? Like what kind of inspired your blog? Oh, Lyrical Lemonade, no Le doubt. Okay. I'm a big, Cole Bennett's probably my biggest inspiration behind all of it, too. He was he had a big influence in making it. Understood. Rightfully so. Cole is one of the biggest. <laughs> yeah, he's... He's, he's definitely pretty. one of the biggest, so... Where do you see your blog kind of, like, going to the next level? Does it kind of so, take it there? I want to start interviews soon. Man, so artists tap in. Yeah, I, I, <laughs> I want to get that going. 
I can get some stuff first, but that's basically just keep rolling and see what I can do, make as many connections as I can, and you know, kind of see what happens. I think interviews would be next for your channel. Yeah. That'd be fire. I'll be um, waiting on that. <laughs> I, 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 that's what I'm most excited. That's the next step for sure. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah. You got a style of interviews you kind of want to do? No, but I want to make them unique. I want them to be different from others. So I don't know if it's, it'll be like the, the setting or what, but I just want to. I want to make them unique and make them stand out. I feel it. That's kind of how we created blazing questions, like mm -hmm. smoking alone. And most yeah. of them like you're drinking or just talking. So it's like a smoke alone, like yeah. a smoke out kind of sort of in ours. Um, so in making your vlog or making anything, how does your, like, your creative process go? Like how do you start your vision for it? So I really think of everything at at work honestly like <laughs> yeah I, I do a lot of repetitive work so i just think all day and kind of that's just my thought process i'm just constantly trying to come up with new ideas every day new series every day constant you hear it. <laughs> exactly and whatever i think of I, I write down in my notes real quick so you're a smart man <laughs> appreciate it uh, they say only 10 percent of people do that you and i want 10 percent. me too <laughs> you know what I'm saying that idea it comes and goes, you know what I'm saying? You gotta capture it real quick. Yeah, yeah. A lot of stuff can happen in a day. Oh yeah, for sure. So, you know, you just gotta make sure you capture your day, your ideas. That's what they call orders to your mind. So Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Look like that, like I just gotta order it to my mind. Just mm -hmm. write that down. Yeah. In my head, that's kinda how I think of oh, it. I see that. <laughs> so, uh yeah, man, that's that's pretty fire. I'll fuck with the blog. I'll be looking for the interviews. Um do you have like do you have a couple artists that you dive into heavy? I uh, I'm a big Almighty Foe fan. I like he was like my third most streamed artist of 2022. I think it was like maybe three four thousand minutes. Okay. And then I like K Ferg 500 out of indie. He was like my fifth most streamed. But there's so much talent, dude. It's like crazy. Like like I. There's we need a bigger platform. Yeah, that's you know? what I'm saying. So we we growing, we growing. Uh, we do have some connections in Houston that we're gonna go tap into real soon. Okay, so we're gonna keep growing every platform. Yeah, so we're gonna send people your way, you know, vice versa. You know Appreciate what I'm saying? It. So, but this is um, hustle high. I mean, we are smoking. You don't smoke. No. But let's dive into something mental that you dive into. You got any books or any podcasts you follow? Books or podcasts? I well, you obviously <laughs> appreciate it. Um, I, I underground sound. Underground they're sound. A, they're a page I kind of was the first rap page to actually talk to me and kind of like guide me a little bit. They got like seventy thousand now followers, so we just kind of. He's, he helped me a lot, a little bit with, like, you know, learning stuff. And it's always nice to lean on somebody to kind of have, like, a mentor setting, you yeah, know what I'm yeah. saying? We all need to grow. Nobody knows everything. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> if you know everything, man, I don't want to be around you. Exactly. Yeah, you know there's always saying? something you can learn. You can always grow somehow. No, like, there's never a time where you just are perfect, you know what I mean? Agreed, agreed. Yeah, man, that's pretty fire. Uh, did you have anything that you want to talk about directly? Mm -hmm. uh, let people know anything you got going on? Just interviews. I do have T-shirts that will be coming out soon. Hey, yeah. So look, let me see. Let me see. I see that. Appreciate the the support. Look, we up next, nigga. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I'm a I'm gonna get those going pretty soon. So make sure to be tapped in with that. Yeah, man. Well, last but not least, since I do have you here in the place to be. Go ahead, drop your name, Preston, any out of next underground raps blog, and let these people know your hustle tip, like kind of what motivates you okay. for every day to get up and be consistent, man. Yeah, so my name is Preston Lake. I run Indian up next, uh, underground raps. And basically, what drives me to be, what drives me to, you know, kind of keep going is like, you're never going to reach your goal if you just stop. Like, I, I, I quit Underground Raps and Indiana, Indiana Up Next for a whole year, the whole 2022 year. So, like, my first year of Underground, I, I, I got 1,900 followers. Stopped for a year. I just, like, mental stuff. I got I just dropped it. And, I understand. And I went a whole year. And then, like, coming up to 2023, I'm like, man. I was like, why did I stop? <laughs> I was like, I made, I made connections while I was doing it. I was like, I just need to keep going. I was like, I don't care. 
what it is. I just need to keep going. So now I got like a really good drive. I just it's kinda, happiness in doing. Yeah. yeah I kind of like just got to keep going. That's kind of my mindset. It's like whether I want to get up and do it, no matter how I'm feeling, there's no reason I shouldn't be productive. What he said, we should be productive. In any situation, you know, we done traveled all the way to Colorado. We done shot three videos, interviews, mm -hmm. trying to be productive, just being consistent. Yeah, that's the thing. Like, if you stop, like, you're never going to go anywhere. Like, ever. <laughs> you gotta, you, you, consistency is key and patience is key, really. Persistence and patience. Damn, hey. this, man, this y'all here dropping knowledge. Look at that. <laughs> I'm here dropping knowledge with y'all, man. So make sure y'all check him out. Make sure y'all tune in to all the artists he's out here tapping in with. Hey, it's gonna go crazy all year, man. As you see him, he's motivated than ever. I'm yeah. motivated than ever. We got a bunch of big shit. So we're gonna be linking in with you. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So I appreciate your time. Yep. Hey, y'all keep hustling, keep grinding. You know the motto. Till next time. <laughs> Alright, bro, that's cool. That's yeah.